Hello everyone, welcome to Sword of Fire, a platform where I discuss truth and I encourage you to be better. If this is your first time or seeing my video, please do also subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the red subscribe button if you are not already subscribed. And if you are a returning subscriber, then like I said before, you guys are the real MVP. us to the topic can Christians partake in a protest now it is no big news that Nigeria is in a very tough season now because of the injustice done to youth in Nigeria many of them have gone into the streets to protest to declare their you know displeasure as a result of the injustice caused by SARS now as a result of this, a lot of persons have been airing out their views, they've been protesting, but then there are some persons that are a little bit quiet and calm about the whole thing. Now, there are a lot of reasons why they are calm about these things, but one of the reasons I perceive to be is as a result of religious beliefs. Now, this brings us to the question, can believers protest? Can they, can they partake in a protest? Well, firstly, I want to state it that Christianity is not a call for stupidity. You being a Christian does not mean that you should swallow whatever placed in your mouth. You know, a lot of persons want to be nice. You know, Christianity has to do with being nice, being good. You're not supposed to protest against authorities and all that, it's against scriptures. Now, I'm going to tell you today that it is a sin for you to keep quiet in a time where there is injustice. Now, I read a pigeon scripture of the time when Jesus had to purchase those people that exchanged money in the, in the temple and he had to chase those sellers and all that from the from the temple Jesus had no mercy on them he had no mercy on them he had to chase them because what they were doing was completely wrong it was completely wrong so he had to chase them and then we see God sending a man named Moses to Pharaoh to tell him to let his people go because Pharaoh had oppressed his people for so long. He had oppressed them for so long and that was the time for God to deliver his children. So God had to send Moses to deliver them. This is a very sensitive period in Nigeria. Nigeria has been through a lot. They have gone through you know, so many trying times and all that. And this is the season where the youth have needed to speak up. So is it a sin for you to speak up to air of you? No, it is not a sin. As a matter of fact, keeping quiet at a very, very sensitive season like this is actually a sin. Yes, it is a sin. God has placed a lot of things in us. So we all have duties at a very sensitive period like this. We have the duties to pray for this nation. We have the duty to speak up against injustice. We have the duty to come out and say what we do not want to see in our country. So it is a crime for you to keep quiet at this particular time. So are Christians allowed to speak up during a time like this? Are Christians allowed to protest? Yes. Are they allowed to do it in a violent way? No. And of course, violence is not part of our virtues but that does not mean we should be calm and then we should accept things that you know that do not go well with us so if you are listening to this video i want to let you know that you have the right to express your displeasure you have the right to say no to police brutality you have the right to say no to sars brutality you have the right to say no to sars so do not keep quiet express your views and let them know that you do not accept their injustice today my heart goes out to the families of those that have been affected by the injustice you know even during the protest a lot of persons have died blood sweat and everything has gone down for has been sacrificed for just this cause today i my heart goes out to all of them all those persons that have been affected and today i'm joining you i'm joining the youth out there to say no to brutality say no to police brutality say no to sars 
thank you very much for watching this video god bless you please want to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already subscribed and make sure you hit the notification button so you can have access to more godly and inspiring content thank you very much i love you all god bless you